Next on the track now, the men's 200 T53. Wheelchair athletes in action here. And the favourite, the British athlete, who's going to be starting in lane six, a product of the Jenny Archer David Weir Coaching Academy. Jomni Moates. Moates, who was the gold medalist in Swansea, also took the 800 metres bronze. Kritsenko of Russia in five might be his biggest threat. But there on the outside is the Italian Ivan Comello Massini, 27 years old. European Championships in Swansea was fourth in the two 100 metres, disqualified in the 200 final. Rustam Aminov of Russia. And Motez Jomni for Great Britain, defending champion. Got the bronze medal in the 200 metres final in Doha last year. Here's Vitaly Gritsenko. Gritsenko, who was fifth in the World Championship 200 last year, also a very good skier. Nicolas Brignoni of France, bronze medal in the 100 metres two years ago in Swansea. Lane two, Arsen Kermanov of Russia making his international debut. And Anna Hel Helgi Larison of Iceland in lane one. He took the bronze medal in the 200 metres in Swansea. So lanes five and six might be where the battle is. Is Montez Jomni. Is it going to be his moment? The 27-year-old British athlete. There he is. Concentrating on getting the best possible start. T53, 200 metres final. Nice clean start. Good start from Motes. Look at the way he's accelerating through there. And also going with him is Gritsenko of Russia. It's between those two seemingly as they come around the bend towards the straight. Larison of Iceland on the inside, maybe in third place. Not a lot between them. And Gritsenko is putting Jomny under a lot of pressure here. The Russians have come here in tremendous form and there's nothing between them. Oh, but a whisker, only a wheel. It's Jomny who takes it ahead of Gritsenko. What a race that was. The time given at 26 Point seven three seconds, and if that's confirmed, it's taken a lifetime best from Jolney to have taken that one. What a race! And at one stage, they came off the bend. It looked as though the upset from the Russian Gritsenko was very much on the cards, but down the straight, Jolney was strong, and by literally a wheel, he takes the gold medal, and it's confirmed a championship record for him and a lifetime best time. Oh, he's taken 0.14 actually off his lifetime best with a major rounding down as tends to happen in wheelchair races, but what a race it was right at the end. He got away brilliantly, but Grinsenko accelerating excellently between 75 and 125, and Jomny just holding on at this stage with around 60 metres to go. He knew Gritsenko was there right alongside. Gritsenko coming all the time. Jomny putting effort, extra effort in, and he only barely got there. Brilliant finish to the race by Mertes Jomny. And what a way for him to defend successfully his European title with that new lifetime best. What effort in the final metres. Yeah, what effort indeed, and that shows how much he needs it and how much it means to him. The great man David Weir will have been watching somewhere, and Dave, the Weir Wolf, who's in action later on, will have been very appreciative of what Jomny has delivered there. And fair play to Gritsenko, the Russian who pushed him all the way. Jomny there, championship record, 26.64 seconds. Kritsenko second, just eight hundredths of a second behind. And another Russian personal best from Kerbinov. He comes through in third place in a bronze. And there's the photo finish. Look at the two up front. Only the matter, well, I said a wheel, it's slightly more than that. But that is close. And they were really motoring when they came down towards the line. Gold medal for Great Britain.